in 2004, uh, Benfica tried to change a little bit this sport type, um, sports policy. So that period, big confusion in the club, and um, the main point is was first build a new stadium, after build a new academy, create a, a department to work uh, with the same philosophy, and then everything started in 2004. Uh, comes a, a new director, and he wants to bring young people with motivation to work, and um, and what happened like that? I was I don't know I was 27 at that time. A lot of people, and now they are also uh, managers, and uh, they, they do a lot of things now in the professional level. Everyone we start there. Everyone we start there. Uh, recruitment it was fundamental. We organize everything, and after after 10 years, so 2004, 2000. 14, we, we start to, to work with that, gen, with that generation. So, if you, most of these names, they born in 94. So, in 2004, most of them would start working with me with 10 years. And, um, and they work, most of them work four or five years with me, two or three years with Luis and with another coaches and they, 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 they grew up. So, it was, I was just, Part of a big team, of a big structure, that uh, with people we want to be same age, young young people who wants to grow up, who wants to learn, who wants every time to improve, every time any every time one season finish, we need to, we we look back and what we see now for the the path we did can be more faster, more faster, and uh, and for sure when we look back this nation, this generation. Especially the guys who were born in '94, they they were fantastic. Maybe you can include more names over there because I can say Ederson. It was our goalkeeper when we were he born in '93, but he, he played with that that players when he when he started working with us uh, under 17. So you have a long, a long long list of players. '94 it was very good. After I think comes '97, it's Renato Sanchez. After comes with Ruben Dias, Ferro, and and still now, still still going. So now it's the machine, the machine already. But and the, every time the machine need to to continue to improve, and they are doing that. That's why for me that, that's not strange because I know I was there when I arrive. The B team, a lot of talents. When I move to the A team, I, I talk with the chairman, and I I need five players right away to start work with me in the first team. And um, and they, they have they have our, the Gonzalo Ramos, Enrique Araujo, top players, and they they are ready to play when the manager wants for the for the the first team. The the most important thing for us is to understand this. So we we start from nothing to create a pathway every time we get to and to turn fast this pathway. But the most important is we need to prepare them. Just for one thing, for the manager who work in the, in the first team, when he sees some quality in the players, he need to push him to put over there, to training with the rhythm, to training with the professional level. So that's, I, that's the most important thing. Advance them ahead of their age, that's the, the most test important. them. We need, that's the thing I, every time I say to, 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 to these kids is, guys, when we arrive to 17, 18, 19, you need to show something for the people who work in the first team, for giving them the chance to train there.